Hello, hello. We are going live, 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 live. I've got my kimono on already. Hello everybody, come on in, come and watch us. We're going live with the amazing Amanda Harrington London. We're gonna do, a little bit nervous, a live tan. You're gonna see how gorgeous these products are. I bloody love them. I don't go, come in, come in. This is the gorgeous Amanda. Hi. This is me. <laughs> Hi. I've got latex gloves on, ready, ready to go. go. This is really exciting. So I've used this tan for years and I've never had you tan me before. I know. But I've used the tan for so many red carpet events. You have, you've been such an incredible fan. Thank I've you. I've been the biggest fan. And I know yeah. that you girls and guys out there love the brand too. So we thought what we'd do is we'd show you how easy it is to achieve this tan. It's a no brainer for any skin tones and it's just gonna be just glorious on you. So. Are, are you start? ready to reveal? I'm going to reveal. I'm going to take off my very sexy kimono. <laughs> and we're going to start at the very beginning because it's a very yes. good place to start. We are. So um, let's just go through it step by step because I know that most of you are just used to just whacking tan on yeah. with one dark brown mud colour. Just the same oh. colour all over. And you know you always get that telltale sign. No matter how much of a prof professional you think you are, there's always that telltale sign around the hands, around the wrists, the elbows, the knees, the feet. Not with this tan. And this is because we prep properly. You do, you prep properly. So before you even get to this stage, which is it's kind of the barrier. It's the first cream I ever made. It's called Ultra Balm. It's all the butters. So it's your shears, your almonds, everything. It's so good for making sure that your wrists, your elbows, everything doesn't catch. Your nails, your, your nails, cuticles. everything. It doesn't catch the DHA. All those really dry areas, which you know that it just the tan grabs. This is all about the prep. What I will say is that yesterday I shaved my legs and my armpits, so 24 hours at least before you tan. And then I also yes, used scrub. the amazing scrub. Yes. So the um, glycol glycolactic scrub, which is super moisturizing. It gets all the dead skin off and it really helps to prep the skin. It's, I'm a big believer in cosmeceutical instead of sugar or, or a kernel in a scrub because it's a, like a hyper exfoliant so the cell turnover is super super quick yeah so that's why in the glycolic scrub you you literally you don't even feel like you're scrubbing it's incredible it's like really that. gentle but really effective and also biodegradable little beads as well so there's nothing that's horrible in these products vegan cruelty free oh god i'm just getting things sticking out. all the boxes so i'm nice and prepped and this is a beautiful like amanda said really nourishing gorgeous balm okay oh my god what's happening now so this is primer so this is the first stage of your three-step tan this is the ultimate gradual tan what this is doing is not only priming the skin for the mousse but it's making sure that the skin absorbs the mousse perfectly all over does that make sense so it's with tan so tan is something called dha so that's the product that's the ingredient that dyes the skin yeah okay that is very drying so you need all the moisture you can get in order for that to sink in beautifully into the skin and not have that do you remember that scaly sort of well, that's the Snake problem. As skin. soon as you, as soon, that's that's one of the with other brands. When you put a fake tan on, then you're just so dry. Yes. You're just dry, you and you do get scaly. And also, back in the day, when you used to get spray tans, and this is why you invented the whole brand, yes. isn't it? Yeah. So it was like kind of '90s on the like you know red carpet catwalks, things like that. It was that like all over one shade, which is really not that flattering. It's not flattering. It doesn't suit your skin tone. As I always say, you you know, it's just like a load of mahogany wardrobes going down the red carpet, <laughs> looking really flat and weird. Yeah. And orange. Yeah. And smelly. Oh my God, the smell. The smell. Biscuits. Yeah. yeah. Loads yeah. of biscuits. Biscuits, smell, that distinctive like, no, I'm not wearing fake tan. Oh yes, you are. I can smell you. But you don't get that at all with this tan, which is why I love it. And it dries instantly as well. Oh, and it feels good. It feels like second skin. It doesn't... You know, as you said, Lisa, it's, it doesn't 
feel like you've got fake tan on. No. You know, which is not what you want. I mean, around the back, everyone. She's just doing. She's just doing a little prep, prep on the back. No stone is left unturned on this tab. Well, there might be a few stones because let's be honest, I'm not going to get it all off. But you would usually. You'd take off your top, maybe your bottoms. I'm not going to go that far. This is this is brave enough already. Okay. Right. Okay. Then we're going to move to moose. Okay. We're going to move to moose. Okay. We're doing the body moose. So it comes in three colours. Let's talk about the tones. We've got natural rose. We've got natural rose, we've got natural honey, and we've got natural olive. You normally wear honey. honey. So the honey is the middle shade. It is almost popular shade. But I think everyone's still looking at it from like light, medium, dark yeah. territory. Yeah. It's not that. This is about looking at it from like a makeup artistry perspective. Mm -hmm. It's honey is like that Californian gorgeous glow. It's Jennifer amazing. Aniston. Jennifer Aniston. It's Jennifer Aniston. She's a client. Yeah. <laughs> it's Jennifer. <laughs> so yeah. when you want to look like Jennifer Aniston, let's be honest with you. Yeah, when you want to look like Jen, uh, you go for honey. But rose, I'm a rose. It's a beautiful color. It's it's amazing. I put violets in it, so it's great if you see the sun burn, lobster style, and then go back to being fair again that's a natural rose it is so incredible that shade and then you've got natural olive which is what we're doing now yeah, what we're doing today which so I've we're never doing been. some beyonce aren't so we? like a beyonce slash kind of nicole scherzinger so i'm going really like gorgeous mediterranean yeah it's a mediterranean color it's great it's got some green in it it's really lovely it's perfect so how much did you put on your hand? A little golf ball size and then yes. rubbed it in. And then I'm rubbing it in. Now what I do with tan, with the, with the mousse, the mousse is like a souffle. So a lot of mousses for me dripped and they stained. And that's what I wanted to get away from. So it's like a, it's literally like a oh, it's tiny. It's I like really feather light. <laughs> <laughs> but I like to build. Yeah. I'm an artist. So I'll do are. a little, I'll do a little, you know, a little make layer. artist slash sunless skin, sun, sun, sunless tan goddess. But most people, yeah, will whack it on. But I like to just put a little bit of layer on and, and then I'll build with a, with a brush. Like okay. I said, I've never had you do my tan before, so I'm li picking up loads of tips. Okay. Um, so the mousse is for the body. The mousse is for the body. And then you have your big body brush. Which is the secret. It's looking good already. It's looking so good already. Look, I'm tanned up, baby. This is one layer. Yeah. So the, the, the other main difference with this is you're not going to put it on, go super, super dark, and then get in the shower and half of it's coming off, which is what you get a lot with, in, with, with towels. Uh, yeah, because you look at yourself in the mirror and you think, oh yeah, I've cooked, I look great. And then you get in the shower and it's all in the shower and then you're pale again. No. But the brush helps to penetrate it into the skin, mm -hmm. also... This colour is what you will be when you wash it off. Really? Yeah. So it, you won't lose the colour. Good. And that's what I wanted. I wanted you to have the control of the colour mm -hmm. based on the amount of layers that you put on. Yeah. That that's what I like about it. And that's why you can experiment with the different shades. Because if you do want to keep layering, you absolutely can. Yes, do my stomach. This is like a multitude of sins. Layer it up, really dark. And also, you can create like because yes, because we're the, gonna do that because because this isn't a, like a one-dimensional tag. It's like you get contours. You can lengthen the limbs. You can create abs if you want. Yes, yeah. you're a proper like six pack. Um, Let's do it. You can highlight areas. Yeah. I don't know if you remember that Amanda and I did a live together before, and we did the Italian shoulders. You had a little bit more on the shoulders. You've got like. A little bit of a swan neck you can do all these contours it's very clever and it's all to do with obviously the great ingredients but the brush the brush is the winner the brush is the key and it comes with these fabulous disposable latex gloves which for me um of i mean mitts most of you might have a body mitt at home yeah okay bin the mitt please, because it absorbs half of your product that you are buying. It is in the sponge. That's what sponges are. They absorb product. Makes absolute sense. <laughs> so, uh, absolute so, sense. So, and they're kind of unhygienic because whoever super. really cleans their spot, their mitt, it's like <laughs> minging. Would you know, I was away, I was doing Cannes Film Festival and 
I was there doing lots and lots of bodies and I was with a bunch of hairdressers and they all wear fake tan. Yeah. And I walked into their bathroom and I saw green mitts pegged up all along the and I was like, guys, and they were like, I know, it's just gone green, I don't know why. But it's again, it's just so unhygienic. So you do see, I was just like, who are you in can doing? I want to know. I know she know. probably can't say, but I can mention some of the clients that yes. you do have and some people that love the tan. So Sienna Miller is a big, big fan. Um, Billy Piper has been recently being turned up. Look, tannish hold happening. Yeah. It's what, you just added some more mousse? Some mousse, straight. Look yeah. That, look at that. And you just swirl it round like this. I think Millie McIntosh is a big fan. Yes, she is. Yeah, Dua Lipa. Yes, yes, you yes, know. yes. Lots. I'm not very good at name, name, name. It's fine, I'll do it for you because I know you're very humble and embarrassed. I'll just like show off for you. But what this is doing, if you add a top to this brush, it's blending into the shoulder. It gives you, and it lifts the shoulder. So what you get is this incredible shape. So it's the top line here mm. into a swirl like that. And look, it just sharpens you up. You look insane like It starts that. to give like and it's structure and, and structure. like highlights the little, or creates little bones and collarbones that you don't actually. And then you can slim the arm. So go underneath yes. this, like there. Flip here, Lisa. So you go underneath the muscle line. Yeah. There. Oh my goodness. And it will give you a shape like that. So you always put the mousse all over first. All over. And then you go and back in you and start, start doing this contour. It's like makeup. Yeah. You put your you put your primer on, you put a, uh, I don't know, whatever, tinted moisturizer, mm -hmm. uh, foundation, then you play with bronzer. Yeah. Then you play with your brown. A bit of contour, yeah. a bit of, you know, shading. But I love doing a darker forearm here. Yes. Because that's what people want, is they want like a darker, because every time you check your tan on your forearm. Yeah. And then you can blend down into the hands. Hands are really good and important. We need to learn how to do these. Because okay. Don't ever, please, go clonk, clonk. Right. Okay. You're going to either pop a bit on there. Yeah. Tiny, look. Tiny, that's tiny, tiny, tiny for the hand, tiny. okay. But this is what these are for, your artist gloves. You can take off the excess and then you can blend into the hand. But this is where you get right into those, because otherwise you have white. Yeah. Do you remember those? Yeah, white of course. Claw. <laughs> do you remember those ones? No, I'm not the one doing my hands, I'm like. Oh. And then you go up and you can just do a bit. So you don't have those lines. Yeah. That's what the brush does, it's incredible. It blends everything out. I mean, I find I, I've made so many mistakes in my life in my tan, and it's like always on those really special occasions when you're like, they go to a wedding or a party or a red carpet event, and you're like, shall I brave it? And then you do, and then you wake up the next day and you just look down, and you're like, oh, I won't swear, but you know what I mean? You want to swear because you're just like, I totally messed it up. So with this brush, it's just so good. Just, just going in the breath. Give me some cleavage, going baby. In the cleaves. <laughs> Look, going in the V. Can you see how, how it's just giving me like golden goddess life? It's great. It's amazing. I just think like, everybody looks better with tan. And that also, arm looks <laughs> It really We're gonna does. We're going to go down here. Okay. We're going to go down here. I'll get very over enthusiastic. I don't mind. Sleep. I don't mind. <laughs> Give me the full treatment, baby. But it's re just remember the body is, it just never, you know, it's all one long canvas to me so just keep gliding it up wherever you see skin you're just going to blend it through yeah okay bingo wing you haven't got any but there we go such a horrible offensive term isn't there the bings the bings i i think we should like ban that word but yes yeah, that area that <laughs> underarm the underarm bit i just love it where you it, came up with bingo wing i think a man uh, okay <laughs> Um, I agree. I think it was bloke. Was it? I'm just oh. saying, yeah. Muffin tops and bingo wings has got that boy. Okay, um, so we're going to do that muscle line here. But also, like, let's talk about darker skins, because I know that a lot of my friends who have got gorgeous, like, glowy dark skin, they're like, I actually don't need tan. And I'm like, yeah. yes, but you do. Like, you it do. really helps to it's a myth. highlight, like we're doing now. It really helps to give you that contour, that highlight, that, you know, even out the skin tone. It does. So. Um, 
a lot of darker or black skins, they can go quite sallow or they can be yellow. So they can have like a blue ashy tone or they can be incredibly yellow sallow. So the best thing you can do is just give it warmth. Okay. So that could be in yellow, which is olive, mm -hmm. or it could be in honey, mm -hmm. if you have, you know, if it's ashy. Okay. And I remember, I remember doing it on a journalist who said, no, 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 I've got, I'm, you know, I've got black skin. I can't possibly come and do your tan launch. And I was the only one she ever went to once we launch, she says, and she's absolutely addicted because it just flips the skin, mm. warms everything up, it looks incredible. It really does. Can you see that though? I mean, that was so super quick. So we're just you doing a little bit. You could do this in your sleep. Are you giving me abs? Yeah, we're just doing flat in my stomach. We're just darkening down the hip line here. Yes, yes. See? Not for this. So we go darker in here. Yeah. And then the whole body will just look more honed. Like mm. this. I love it. This is so exciting. I know. This I is know. really exciting. So we're gonna do the face as well, because obviously you know that Amanda's got the amazing face mist, which I use as makeup. You see me, I use it all the time. Um, and, and I just love just like it just gives you that gorgeous bronze. It's exactly a lowy look. You don't need to use like a like a bronzer. I mean, you can do if you want, but I just feel like it just put it on straight away and go off to work. You don't need to do it before bed. I know you like to do the three step at night before bed, yes. but I like to do it in the daytime because I like to go out with my tan on. Yeah, but it's great either it way. Does now. You can you know if you're going out, you can do it halfway through the day in the office. Yeah. I always put it over makeup, and it, you do, and it does stay. Yeah, yeah. So it's incredible. And a lot of people have definitely forego, you know, they, they forego foundation now. Yeah. And they just use that as their base and that concealer. Well, that's because it covers a multitude of sins. And I think as soon as you look in the mirror and you've got a bit of color, and because the ingredients are so lovely, like it's got hyaluronic acid, it's got yeah. all like the vitamin. CQ10, yeah. it's got the aloe vera, it's amazing. The C, the E, like it's just really like glowing. She knows her stuff. Oh, you really do. I know, I'm so you look impressed. Product, so you I really look. do. I'm like, I'm, you know better than me. No, I don't. I really don't. Well, I'm too busy in bathrooms. <laughs> um, yeah. That's it. That's gorgeous. Look at that compared to the leg. I mean, I can't leave the leg out. No, don't leave the legs out. <laughs> but we do the whole thing. I've never been olive before. This is amazing. So what you do is you leave this for eight hours, right? Yes. To let it you know, just, just before you wash your hands or wash anything. I mean, I did some this morning and I just went straight out. It dries immediately. Do not worry. Hold on, let me just... It doesn't smell. Nice. It doesn't smell. So you don't need to do that classic Thursday night tanning with this. I sort of based it on my clients who... Oh, I mean, <laughs> I always think back as to who I modelled my range on yeah and there was one client who was in breakfast tv actually and i used to tan her at sort of 5 a.m half asleep she was in bed sort of one limb coming out one limb coming out here and then there would be a leather trouser going on <gasps> the minute i finished the tan i said i've got to make sure my products dry survive. immediately yeah. and oh, yeah yeah and that's why it took a long time really? to make them yeah I mean, it's not easy, is it? I mean, you've really had to make it vegan, 43. So, I mean, how did you get it not to smell? Because that stinky, distinctive smell is like minging. It's not, it's not, it, it just took a, t it just, it's to do with the ingredients in it. Um, and you can, you know, you have a lot of aroma guards and it's what I sit it in. So I don't sit it in alcohol, right? So it's, it's not drying and alcohol can sort of bring out the smell of the soggy biscuit. I'm sorry, <laughs> which is what we don't want. I don't know. Okay, um, so just to reiterate, we've done the miracle. Down the miracle the <laughs> we've done the miracle balm of all the really uber dry areas, which is like this one, which is gorgeous, the ultra balm, right? And that's got all the butters in it. So that's for your nails, your cuticles, your hands, and your dry bits. Then we put the gradual tan on. Yes. which is your primer yeah that is your primer and if you were to use it every day would it give you color yes it would minimal but minimal color yeah so i just like to have that in my bag just to keep my tan moisturized once i've done the mousse once i've done the, the mist right is she can you see her <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, I feel like I should have a martini. I just be like, this is how I spend my life. <laughs> sit in a crotch, you know? Just sit in a crotch, in a boobs, in a bum. Yeah, yeah. So who was this person that used to do for breakfast tea in the morning? Who wears leather pants? Oh, I've, had so, I've got so many stories. So many stories. Oh my God. I have, I have one actor. Yeah, I'm not like ever going to gonna name names. Blokes do, blokes look great with this town as well, right? Look incredible with this town. Do you go town. on to film sets and do lots of towns? I used, I used to do films all the time. Mm. But um, I now, yes, I now do actors for films. Yeah. Or just to change their shape, because I can change the shape of them. Mm. And some of them are maybe too ripped or not ripped enough. Too ripped. <laughs> It's true. Two ribs. You tone down the two. Yeah, you have to circle make it them out. out. Yeah. Flatten it out. Yeah. Well, and that's there's. The opposite of what but it's so it. fascinating tanning an American actor versus mm. an English actor, yeah. for instance. And, and you know, how, I suppose, body shy an English actor would be over an American. An American actor would have three different mirrors. Really? Yeah, to look at. A bit like me, though. <laughs> No, Quite. Mirrors, I'm talking like Guys, we had to set up. I mean, there's a multitude of mirrors in here for her. Office. I wish. I wish. <laughs> no mirrors, no mirrors. So we've done one coat of the mousse on my legs. Now we're going in to add some lengthen. Yes. Contour, darken it a little bit. And yeah. because you put the Miracle Balm over, Ultra Balm over the knees, we don't have to worry because sometimes I worry that I should avoid the knees. Yes. And maybe just use a little bit what's left on the brush. I do that anyway. I do avoid the knee. So I go in underneath the knee. And then I lengthen and slim on each side of the calf and go down into the foot. Like that. Oh my gosh. So you can create a really beautiful line up the side of the thigh. And, it gets, and then into a jockey bum. Jockey you know? bum. So you can darken down here. And what, the little hollow? That curve, yeah. I love all your little names for things. It's a jockey bum. Jockey bum. But it gives you that, that like muscle and the length. I mean, your legs are insane. You don't need to do any of this on you. Really do. But it's just nice to sharpen them up a bit. Yes. Look at these legs. Oh my God, this is so exciting. I'm literally going to go out in hot pants tomorrow. <laughs> Not. That's beautiful. Um, there we go. I wish I could see some questions. I know, I can't see any questions because I can't see from here, but we will come and have a look in a minute. I think Amanda Harrington London is on there. Oh, this is obviously this is Amanda Harrington here, but the team are answering questions. So get your questions in. We've got a code for you to use if you want to shop, which I'm sure you will. Um, it's Lisa 20, 20% 20 off of everything. Um, and it's beautiful skincare as well, as well as all your tan. So you're going away? I'm going away, fingers crossed. I'm going away on Friday, so this lasts until then. Yes. If I don't wash. <laughs> it will last, it will last 10 days. I'm tanning the bum now, everyone. It's a fabulous option. Do you want to see a bit more of it? <laughs> yeah. It's going to give you a bit more cheek so that I don't have any weird lines when I'm away. Um, sorry, Amanda. You're going to like olive. I don't think you're going to go back to honey. Really? No. We converted, even yeah. for my face, even yeah. for the mist. Okay, oh, we'll, see. Know, we'll, see, we'll see. We'll see, we'll see, we'll see. Um, we'll see. So what I would say is though, baths obviously make it fade quicker, hot baths, steam rooms, things like that, right? Yes, so exactly. So the more water you're in, the more water... <laughs> I'm round the side of the bunk. The more water you're in, me and my mate, <laughs> my extra bottom... <laughs> but the more water you're in, the quicker it's going to fade. Exactly. So like... Go for cooler showers, shorter showers. Pat, you know, just... pat dry on the on the towel. But also, you know, this is a brilliant thing about this is it's not a once a week, oh right, I've got a scrub, I'm gonna take my tan off. Just take your mousse bottle and your brush. Yeah. And just and just whack on a layer or just you know, it's so easy. You can right. do it in your sleep, genuinely. Don't worry about it. We'll put the gradual on for a couple of days. And so if you do it in your going. sleep, it's not going to stain your sheets either, no. which is really good. <laughs> no, because there's the... no light <laughs> shape of your body when you wake up the next day, which is amazing. I mean, look at that. Look at that. I literally, it covers multitude of sins. It makes you just look so much better, doesn't we it? We could do and we could, we could show you the before color, but it's round the back. Let's do it. I don't mind. Is it really, is it okay to do that? <laughs> What's up to you? There you go. Can you see? It's 
You can see, like, that is like proper bum. Sorry, Builder's bum there. I should actually show my bum crack live on Instagram. <laughs> I mean, I really don't give a boop, do I? Um, it's beautiful. It's amazing. You're done. And it's so quick. Yeah. Um, you're going to do my face though, aren't yes, you? Yes, really okay. quickly. Because I think it's really important that people learn how to do it properly. Obviously, I showed you how to do it, guys, and I think I've sort of kind of perfected it. But I think you always that look amazing with that. I, sh I mean, I, I mean, if I, it, I, you have to tell me to stop because I just won't stop, and I won't tell you to stop because I just <laughs> want to be darker. I'm like, give me more. I will color. keep going round and round the body, tanning. Um, what I will say, which is really exciting, is I love having my facial mist with me, my tanning facial mist in honey, which I might swap over to olive. Yeah. But you've got this really cute little jet set duo, which is really new and it comes with a little tiny mini brush and a little spritz and you get your gloves and you can just take it if you are on holiday and you can just do what Amanda's about to do in a minute and do some like shading contouring just adding that bronzer using it as makeup basically I just um, can't stop hold on I'm coming she's coming I'm, I'm gonna coming. do face um right let's no do need for face. a mitt Nins. no need for a mitt did you not hear what she said about the mitt do not use the mitt can we use can we should we use a little one yeah use a little one mm. let's use a little one okay I mean, you could use both. This is the Jet Set Duo. Look at the diddy little brush. This is honey, though. Hold on, kids. Hold, please, kids. Uh, Just do the normal one. It's fine. But they're over there. This is olive. Okay, we're going dark. Just imagine it's in a small. Okay. We're going dark. I'm excited. What do you want me to do? Face you? I'm very excited about your tan. I'm excited about your tan. Do I have to be like... God, I look really quite fair next to you. You have really given me... I'm quite envious now. Mm. <laughs> Beautiful. So, all over the face colour. So just do the base. Don't forget the ears. Go all the way around the ears. This is why these are awesome because you can get in the hairline. There's none of that white gap anymore that you used to get with tan. Yeah. So just work your way around the base. You cannot go wrong. This brush is brilliant because it's like a super blender, and this is super light. Mm. So you're not, it's not scary. I, I know, know we get a lot of comments. Oh, what if I go wrong? You can't. Can you say? You can't go wrong. It's a no brainer when you've got the brush. Yeah, that's really you, close. And if you love to use your makeup, then you will know how to use this product. And you just add your, like you said, you wear it over makeup sometimes, over your SPF. I love to wear it over the primer, yeah. um, over the ultimate balm. I use it over Hyalonics peptides, yeah. SPF, I mm -hmm. use it over 10 layers of serum and then, and it still works and looks beautiful. So now we put in a cheekbone. So a cheekbone comes from the top of the ear. It's, it's higher than you think. We're not here, we're here. Right. So you're going up there. See, I wouldn't do it like that. I'd do it where I, th where I thought the... Yeah, no, it's here. Mm. So it's the top half and that will give you the lift. And then you go into the temple and you lift the outer temple here and then it gives you a shape. Can you see? Mm -hmm. It's slimmed down the face, hasn't yeah. it? Completely straight away. Yeah. It's wonderful. It's so easy. But this will last two, three days. So it's like a semi-permanent structure. And then you can, I mean, not, I've already said how enviable I am about your nose, but you can just slim the nose and you can also be really clever and go in the corners here. Like, what does that do? So that lifts also lifts the eye. You do. I know you've got makeup on here, but just do it. It's quite cool to do that bit. It's all these little tricks. And it just. There we go. And so you haven't gone for this whole flat face of tan, which I think no. we all just got into so many bad habits back in the day. This is contouring. This is making it really pretty and using it as makeup. That. Mm. Let me sharpen the chin and the jaw. Like that. God, it's this is clever. Go down the sides of the neck as well. So you go round the jaw. You can hide the double chin a bit. No, well, no just in the chin okay. and then you shorten the nose. If you've got a long face and you, you want to sort of shorten everything, that's also a very cool trick. Like that. You're so clever. And then you, and then you. <laughs> You're so clever. <laughs> and then this is cool. Going down this. It's called the swan neck. So it's down into here and then across here. 
up and down like it. Look at that. But then what, you know, oops, sorry, honey. What we're doing is <laughs> nearly finished here. <laughs> You're joining everything together. Yeah. So we've darkened this, we've darkened that, and everything then becomes one. You look amazing. It's amazing. Look at that. Mm. And that took us, well, mm. it took us, I didn't do anything. <laughs> it took us 25 minutes, 30 minutes with talking as well. So it's all about prepping the skin, getting it ready, and using these products with your gloves, with the brush. Aww. I love it. Oh, I'm a sun kiss and I've got an olive. So capri. Was this was this olive on my face or was this honey? This is olive. Olive, olive, olive all over, which obsessed. I've never gone to before. I'm obsessed. Remember, it's Lisa20. If you want to use any of the buy any of the products, you get 20% off. How long is that lasting for? Do we know? A week. A week. LS20. It's L LS20. I'm so sorry, it's LS20. Got it wrong. <laughs> LS20, capitals LS20. Um I don't know, I'm just really excited. Well, yeah, that's good. Yeah. Everyone, just so you know. <laughs> really happy with that it's amazing and i'm converted now to olive yes yeah, so it's not going to go any darker than this no. this is the color i'm going to get and i'm not going to wash for three weeks no. it's <laughs> stunning yeah i'll do some it's pictures. such a holiday tan yeah you know but it just gives you the holiday color. but also like if we're not going away anywhere let's be honest hopefully i'm going away that might not happen but um you just it just makes you feel so much better about yourself then you want to look in your wardrobe and wear more colors do you your know what eyes I mean? are popping everything's up it's fab Cheekbones so galore. Good. Thank you, honey. So much I love Thank it. You. I don't know if do you want to have a see if there's any questions, or I think your guys may have already answered them all. I hope so. Oopsie, that's not right. Um, I bought Amanda Harrington's products on your last live. Love them. I might have to try the body tan. My facial spray went green though after a while. That's weird. Heat. Heat. Be careful of that. Yeah, um, bathroom heat. Okay, we'll store it away from there. What I like to do is, um, Susie said it's so easy when somebody else does it. Yes, it is, but with the brush, it will just help you and the mitt and the gloves to really get that product yeah. in, right? Totally. And it, I, it looks hard, but it's not, I promise, because I have clients who I've been doing for 15 years and I've been going in their bathrooms. Yeah. Lockdown. Yeah. Sorry, everyone, you're gonna have to do it yourself. I have not seen them since. Really? No. So Amazing. That's a good gauge. Somebody's saying it's difficult to see the application with the comments. I'm so sorry. I will post this on my main feed and it's gonna go up onto Amanda's page as well so you'll be able to see it properly. The brush is game changing. I never turn with the mitt. Yes, exactly. Um, and it's instantly touch dry. Yeah, it is. Um, I'm trying to think. What else? If you would have said. <laughs> Sweet comment. Everyone's in love with your tan. It's amazing. Yes. It's amazing. Absolutely amazing. So LS20. Um, how soon can you wash your hands? It's not advisable to do that. I mean, it's just, you've got to be sensible, haven't I you? I did it this, okay. So this morning I put some mousse on half asleep at half five and then I washed my hands at eight. Oh, tan is good. People are like saying, what is it cool comments on? So on, but it looks amazing like i said it will be posted onto my page so i'll be able to see as it has it as it went on um i think do we tan the feet yes we've tanned the feet we've done everywhere we've done everywhere um okay we're gonna love you and leave you right yeah. come in come Lots in love say hi and say goodbye hi. we love you all thanks i think for i need to have a tan lisa will you tan do you? Know? yeah I should, you know, we should do a role reversal next time. See yeah, if I've actually for it. listened properly. <laughs> That's not pressure. Um, thank you all for watching. Um, I'm just super happy. I've got an amazing time by Amanda Harrington. Lots of love. Lots of love. Have a good evening. Bye. <laughs>